rested saved. Got that couple wishes back, re-equipped the Masamune, and now we are ready to move on. Um, uh, we're... well, Jack is kinda... and Jock, I guess you could say. His, he's always been Jock. Jock has always been a little bit misleading. Um, so why would you assume that it's any different today? Um, he pretty much implied that we need to go to the Mana Fortress. That's not necessarily where we are going today. Um, you might be a little confused because this is the Lost Continent. This is actually where we need to go. How you're supposed to know to go here is a little bit beyond me, but this is where you need to go. So let's head inside the Mana Fortress here. And here we find the Emperor, the first time we get to see the Emperor, I believe. So, no, the second time. He also put us in jail that one time. So glad to see you. You're going to like this. The ancient continent will surface once I've broken all the palace seals. Once I break this lost seal, the Mana Fortress will rise. He's got two cronies with him, too. Too bad you won't be around. Who wants the job? I owe them one since the Republic. Leave it to me. The Republic? Sheiks. What guy's name is Sheiks? And off go the other two guys. You, you're the Dark Stalker. Behold, have a taste of my true power. So it is now boss time. We're up against Sheiks. I wish that was the boss's name. That would make this a lot easier. The Underworld gives us its strength. I'll squash you. The contract we signed with the Underworld gives us control of this world. Keep humans under my control. We're reviving the Mana Fortress. Now your time is over. Unless I am able to pull this off. Uh, chances are I'm probably not going to be able to, but we'll see. Earth slide on the... God. I don't know how to say that. Agagropalon? That's what I ha I mean, I need it in front of me whenever I have to pronounce it. Uh, so this is what we're up against. We're up against Sheiks, though. I like that better. Uh, let's go for Earth Slide all around. We'll see if I can chain cast that. However, he does love, 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 love to cast Wall on himself. So I might cast that on myself by accident. Uh, but if I can chain cast this, this is going to be great. Uh, this this is not a good um, ability to chain cast. Uh, but if I can if I can pull this off. That's going to be that's going to be it. He is weak to to earth slide. And it, ah, there we go, there we go. But he died anyway. <laughs> Down goes a guy cheeks. Down he goes because I cheaped him out. Uh, you have to be careful with this guy. Uh, he can do a lot of damage to you. Unfortunately, I didn't get to show that off because I cheaped him out too damn fast. Way to go! Uh, so you have to heal a lot. Spears Orb, if he gets that wall off, it can be can be pretty tough. I can't believe this! The stage is just above us. Let's go! Okay, sure. Um, oh, no. We don't want that. We don't want... No. Oh. And we can't go that way either, so let's just follow the way that they went, which is probably what I should have thought of doing before. But we can head up here, and we have made it to the eighth mana seat, the last one. The seal's melting. We're not going to make it. Use it. Use it before it's too late. No good, it's too late. No. Why, mana seed? Get out of here now. It's a palm tree. I am Dryad, the tree spirit. The seals on the world's seeds have been broken. The continent that sleeps beneath this palace will soon rise. Leave now. What about you? I wasn't able to save this palace. I'll go down with it. Idiot! What will that serve? Come, help us save mana! Thanatos sealed my mana magic. I won't be of much help. Don't worry, let's go! Hurry. Well, okay. I'll do what I can. And we have gained Dryad's power! Oh no, it's rising! Call Flammy! And unfortunately, I don't have a choice. We have to leave. But it looks like the continent is raising. This isn't good. So we're told. This is bad. Whatever the ancients wanted to seal, it means it needed to be sealed. But unfortunately, it looks like we are done here. Well, actually, I think we could land here, but I'm going to go back to Matango and heal.
just to get the MP back and level up uh, the spear. I'll be right back here. Alright, all rested and healed and ready to move on. Let's land right back where we were. We can do this. We, we need to go right back. And we have enemies here, Dark Knights, that we need to get rid of. They cast wall on themselves as if I was playing on casting magic when I can pretty much one-shot them. Down they go. Alright, we do... Oh, we have a couple treasure chests here. We also have an upgraded spear. Magical armor! Nice, I will check that out when I get a chance. Probably right after I grab this. Oh, which is a gauntlet inside. Uh, I did level up the... Spear, which is now a Gigas Lance, and is a ton of damage. So much more than the Massamune. Pretty much like the... What is it? The Axe? The Lance? They're all... I mean, you do just as much with the bow as you do with the Massamune. It really... They really underpower the sword in this game, I feel. They really want you to go for something else, but the sword is iconic, damn it! You, you want that. Alright, let's see what we can do with the uh, armor that we grabbed. Let's see, we have Battle Suits, which is what was for sale last, and Magical Armor Socks, and the Gauntlet from 35 to 90. Holy crap. Yes. Yes, 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 I want that. How you doing, Gemma? Jake, the Sun Continent has surfaced. The fortress is there. I've brought troops here to keep the Empire from taking the Mana Fortress. There's an ancient city under this grand palace. We must get into it. Emperor Vandal is working for the Underworld. This place is full of monsters. Though your sword isn't fully powered, you need it to stop the Emperor. We'll fight off the Imperial troops here. You can catch up with those soldiers. Reading apparently is tough for me today. Uh, there's also more enemies down there, but I would rather go in here. Much better of an option. We can't go any further. Look for another way. No. We can't go the way that I was going before. Damn you. Now we have to take on these ridiculously easy enemies again. Anytime you want to help out, Gemma, that would be appreciated. Is he still not dead? There we go. It's like, seriously, Gemma, you're just walking right past the enemies. That is not cool. Alright, let's see what else we can do around here. Doesn't look like there's anything this way. Probably not anything this way either. There is an enemy over here. We, we have seen this enemy though. What did it spawn? It spawned a... Oh, an upgrade duck. Oh crap. What kind of... What kind of duck sorcery is this? What is your name, duck? Oh, we never got a chance to look over uh, Dryad's magic. Okay. Uh, not very much. Uh, we got Revivifier, uh, which will revive a uh, party member, of course. And then we've got Wall, uh, which we have been seeing for quite a bit. It's Reflect. Uh, those are she and Magicals, of course. And Yancey now also has Dryad. I'll spend some time leveling that up now that we have all seven spirits. And we do, well, sorry, all eight spirits, seven for each of them. Um, and we do have all eight mana seeds somewhat. Uh, we have uh, Sleep Flower, which I'll probably use very often. We have seen that, well, I've definitely seen that way too damn much in Burst, which we did see in the last battle. Probably be using Sleep Flower to level up. And we have a Shapeshifter and a Captain Duck! Not too far off from GI Duck, Drill Sergeant Duck, but Captain will do. Really? That didn't do damage? That's ridiculous. Alright, once again, I need to power up for this guy up here. Hopefully I can get that level 6 very, very quickly. Damn it. Damn it, Captain Doc. Why? Why don't you die faster? Exploder level 5. That only did one damage before, though. Yeah, one damage. Yeah, get whacked, Captain Doc. This guy, this guy's pretty tough, but he's not really dishing out damage to us. He, he is taking quite a bit of it, though. Down he finally goes. What do we got in here? Another gauntlet? That'd be greatly appreciated. Uh, Royal Jam! We have not seen Royal Jam before. I believe that, uh... Actually, have we seen Royal Jam? No, no we haven't. You only got the one. Okay, that, I believe, heals your uh, HP to full. If I remember correctly. Heals something to full. So much so that I'll probably never use it. Because then I, I, I won't want to use it outside the final battle. And then when the final battle comes, I'll forget that I have it. Hooray. 
or I won't need it. You know, I save it, save it, save it, and then never use it. It's the best strategy of all time, I swear. How you doing, buddy? Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. I, I What would I do without you? Probably just kill this guy in three shots instead of just two. There he goes. So hopefully I can get the level ups shortly. Nothing more, so let's just continue heading down. We do have a new enemy here. Uh, what is this guy's name? Is this a steel pin? I think this is the steel pin. What is your name, buddy? Metal Crawler is not the Steel Pian. Steel Pian comes later. And he shot fire out of his mouth. Damn you, Metal Crawler. You're not supposed to have fire? Hit him again. There we go. Down he finally goes. Took way too damn long. Let's go into the water. Take on... I think we have seen these fish before. The Dino Fish. Uh, aren't they the ones that launched the Magicka? Like the, the missiles out of their back. Here we go, Steelpian. He looks like a scorpion, which would make more sense than the guy that I was hitting. But still, we got two metal bug enemies, and I get him confused. That's pretty much how I think. And we have another metal crawler who wasn't crawling there. He was hovering and flying. What the hell kind of crap is that? That's not loud yet. Dino fish are the ones that had the missiles coming out of their back because fish. They can also jump right onto the land, which I've never understood either. But these guys are just built to confuse me, aren't they? That, that is their primary intent in life, is just to confuse me. And I can't go through that. That looks like I should be able to go through that. And I'll leave those guys alone, take on more dino fish if I can. Nothing this way. Anyway, die. Now we can move on and head over to the left. Now we can actually find a path forward if you guys would let me. Oh no! Not my, not Jake's precious magic. He uses that all the time. Damn it, die, Dino Fish! There we go. And we do find sewers leading inside with more steel pins. And a treasure chest. Anytime there's a treasure chest, that is a good day! <laughs> they don't give those out very much. Okay, head over here. Wait, what? Now I'm confused. Hold on for one second. I don't remember these things. Oh, that's right. Just need an axe in order to chop these down. Did not remember that. And there is a treasure chest over there, so I want to go get it. In here, we can get the boomerang's orb. Very nice. Most treasure chests in this game are the orbs. What do you want me to say? And God, there's so many of these. So there's going to be less time for me to level up the sword. All right, clear the path all the way through. Uh, there is a path uh, to the left of here, but you don't want to take it. <laughs> Trust me on that. It is the way, uh, well, you will see. You will see. Uh, poison, not too concerning. What is more concerning is that we do have a new enemy up here. We have the Kimono Wizard. Upgrade Kimono Bird. He's no longer a bird. It got upgraded to, to a wizard. And it looks like we poisoned it. And these guys, of course, love to cast wall, but there we go. I do not believe... Oh, we haven't gone over Dryad? we gone over Dryad? Yeah, we went over Dryad. This guy, Komodo Wizard, did not cast anything. Uh, didn't cast wall on himself. So, burn. 